first-generation students are the first in their family to go to college, but they have a 45% dropout rate. That's twice the dropout rate of regular college students. And they're often dealing with other stresses, working jobs while going to school, uh, babysitting uh, siblings or members of the family, or dealing with pressure from their family and even from their culture. Chris Berry is a graduate student at the University of Nevada, Reno. He helps to run the school's Mosaic Initiative that reaches out to first-generation students and helps them stay in school. Chris Berry decided to make a documentary about these students. He came from a long line of college graduates, and he wanted to know what first-generation students were dealing with that made their situations difficult. The Chancellor of the Nevada System of Higher Education, Dan Claych, said, The budget cuts of 2011 will limit access and opportunity to thousands of Nevadans, either by limiting enrollment or by pricing higher education out of their reach. The fruits of a college degree remain a defining element of American life, an element that is increasingly becoming too expensive and selective, especially for students whose parents have not gone to college. To be competitive and develop a diversified economy, Nevada must be committed to the success of a new generation. This new generation will largely be students who are the first in their family to go to college. These students are Nevada's future. They are Nevada's first generation. <laughs>